We had the pleasure and the honor of hosting Pete Hexett and Lisa Daftari from Fox News together with Joe Frager, Delia Jacobs and many others who came to Osvegaon. Osvegaon, as you know, was found at the night that the boys, the three boys were found murdered as a Zionist response to the murder. Osvegaon and a lot of other places in Israel were founded as a Zionist response to the physical murder of Jews by Arab physical Arab terror. But there's another terror that is going on in the world, and that is the terror of the spreading of the lies. There's a terror of people, of Arabs and the left in the world, and unfortunately also in Israel, who are spreading lies, lies about Israel, lies as if we are conquerors here, occupiers, as if this is not our land, as if we have no right to be here. This is also terror. It's another kind of terror. It's a terror where they want to destroy Israel, not with guns, but with lies. And the soldiers who fight against this, you have the soldiers who fight the real terror, the soldiers, uh, the police, etc. And you have the soldiers who fight the lies, the terror of lies, is the people who have a microphone, who have a media, whichever, thank God, they know how to fight all those lies. And we have, thank God, also abroad, like Fox News, people who want to know the truth. And Pete today, and Lisa today, and other people on Fox News, they are soldiers who fight the terror of lies by telling the truth. It's not that there's n two narratives. Some, we live in a postmodern world where people say, oh, there's that narrative and that narrative, maybe you're right and maybe you're right. No, there's one narrative. The land of Israel belongs to the people of Israel. There's not two narratives. They, the Arabs, tell the lie, we tell the truth. And today we had the pleasure and honor of meeting Pete together with uh, the whole de delegation who came, who've been with, have been with him for the whole week, giving him the truth about here and we are happy that he will be a representative of the truth together with his friends in Fox News and uh, we welcome him and we say good luck and we uh, of course had the uh, uh, pleasure and honor to uh, welcome Pete here in Osvegaon together with those who Without whom Osvegan would not have been possible to be made. Of course, the uh, uh, deputy mayor of uh, Gush Etzion, Moshe Savil, who represented, of course, also the mayor of Gush Etzion, David e. Pearl. And uh, uh, when we went up here the first night, was all together. And since then, we've been working together. Uh, and this is the opportunity to once again say Kolakavod uh, and thank you to them for the incredible work they are doing. And this is also an opportunity to say thank you to the Aucheva for the incredible work you are doing on being soldiers for the truth, which is not easy in our world.